Let's go ahead and assemble the arm with the hand. This gives you a finished idea of what it should look like. I'm not going to need the ruler, so I'm going to go ahead and dismiss that. I'm going to bring over the arm, and I'm going to put a work plane on top of it. I'm going to bring over what looks like the wrist. And right now it's under the work plane, so I'm going to hit the D key. I'm going to slide it over with my arrow keys. I'm going to go ahead and align this. Align it according to length and width. This one is already aligned. Both parts are still selected, so I'm going to go ahead and group them. If they change color, go ahead and click on multicolor. Next thing we'll do is we're going to put the palm on top of the wrist. I'm going to get another work plane, drop it on top, drag over the palm, hit the D key to put it on the work plane. I'm going to slide it over with my arrow keys to approximate it. I'm going to align it and then I'm going to adjust it. I'm going to end up dropping this down into the wrist a little bit more. So let's go ahead and align this length and width. All right, let's go ahead and enlarge this. I'm going to go ahead and just deselect. All right, let's click on the palm and let's drop this down in. And I'm going to drop it in just enough so that there's a little bit of a collar on it. If you want to drop it in more deeply so that you don't have a collar, that's certainly fine. All right, now I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to go ahead and group that. All right, next part is to go ahead and bring over the finger and then the fingertip. I'm going to go ahead and return the work plane to its original location. Go ahead and enlarge a little bit. All right, I'm going to bring over the finger and a fingertip. I'm going to put a work plane on top of the finger. While this is chosen, I'm going to go ahead and hit the D key to put it on the work plane. Use my arrow keys to bring it close. I'm going to go ahead and align this. length and width. And then I'm going to go ahead and deselect it. I'm going to drop the little fingertip down in here. And I'm going to drop it in a little bit more deeply so that it looks very smooth, like it's one piece. I'm going to select all. I'm going to go ahead and group. All right, I'm going to go ahead and zoom out of here. Let's go ahead and drop the work plane back to where it originally was. Okay. Join me in the next video. We'll go ahead and we'll start attaching the fingertips and then we'll duplicate them and we will rotate them around the palm.